hello everyone in this tutorial i will show you how you can create this type of background glow so i don't know the any use case of this but it's fun so, so let me show you how we can create this so first of all this is a blank page as you can see let's add a new section in here and let's make three column so this is our column and let's give it a minimum height of this section like this and let's add a background or dark colors so that the color pops up so i'm adding this one for example okay so in this middle column we will add this content and the glowing background so let's add a heading in here first heading then let's add some text and some button okay so change these setting colors button color and let's add some padding background color first so let's make this like turkish something like that and let's add some margin maybe or oh, and some padding okay so it's looking better so let's add the glowing background first of all we need to add a class in here so i'm giving a class of glow and we also need to set this z index to 2 okay perfect so let's save this so this is our column with our content so let's add some css in here so the class of our column was glow so let's take this class and if we inspect our column as you can see the actual column wrapper is elementor dash column dash wrap so let's target this column that column wrap okay so elementor elementor column wrap and let's add a position of relative and now we will target this exact column or div and we will add some after tag so glow elementor column red after so first of all let's add content that will be blank we don't need any contents and then add position to absolute and set the top to zero left zero right zero Okay. Also set the Z index to minus one, negative one, so that it sits under this column. Okay, perfect. Now set the height to hundred percent, so that the height area covers the full area and the width hundred percent as well. So that will be our height and width. okay so let's add some background gradient color you can use any gradient code for example let's use this one and paste in here background gradient degree and the color code we cannot we can remove this percentage or you can keep it as well so our background will be this gradient color okay or maybe the color i'm using in this example this is the color code so this will be our background so now we need to scale this background color a little bit bigger or smaller so let's save it first so if you refresh this as you can see nothing changes because first of all we need to as you can see we have some blur effect so we need to add this blur so we will add a css filter 
filter blur and let's make it 100 pixel okay so let's save and refresh let's see what happens as you can see this is our background and with our blur effect so let's make it a little bit smaller or bigger so how we can do that we can add css transform transform and we will scale scale you can scale it just like you want if you let's say if you want the bigger glow you can make it like two times and if you refresh as you can see the glow is now much much bigger so we don't need that we can set it like 0.9 so it little bit smaller than the actual column save this as you can see it's a little bit smaller than the actual column itself so this will be our transform scale we can also increase the background size a little bit so let's background that's this is not necessary but you can do that background size let's make it 200 percent 200 percent so as you can see a little subtle change has happened so this one color is overtaking the other that's perfect so now we need to animate this gradient so we will add we will use css animation so animation and give the animation a name you can use any name so i am using animate glow maybe and you can set the animation duration in here so in this in our case let's set it to 3 second so it will be faster and let make it ease and infinite so that it loops infinitely that's perfect so we will add an animation that name of that animation will be element glow it will run three second and infinitely so now let's create that animate glow animation so we will use keyframe animation so i will provide all the css code in the video description so don't worry you can just copy paste so let's add keyframe and name of the animation we have given so this will be here and in here we will use 0% 50% and 100% so in 0% our background position will be will change only change the background position so back background dash position our position will be 0% and 50% for the let's duplicate this copy and for the 50% our background will be 100% and 50% and for the 100% our background will be again 0 to 50 so let's save this let's look how it works okay as you can see nothing is happening because this in here I we will have keyframes not keyframe okay that's my mistake sorry so now if we refresh this as you can see our background is not changing that's perfect so you can use this back glowing or background changing effect in anywhere for example let's add this glowing effect to our button as well so the class of let's add a class of our button let's make it like glow button okay so glow button and if we inspect this the actual wrapper is elemented button link so let's copy this glow button elementor button link and you can just copy this one 
this animation and the background and background size so now if we save this if we refresh as you can see our button color is also changing according to our background color so this looking awesome this is how you can create this type of glowing effect in elementor and with a little bit help of css so i hope you guys like this tutorial so if you like this tutorial please do share with your friends i will see you in the next video